what is up bro gamers welcome to greater somalia part five or part four or maybe even part six because i never remember the parts that i'm doing anymore so let's just say it like that let me be clear i don't remember most of the parts that i do for mostly every let's play but here we are all you guys need to know is that ethiopia has declared war on me i was trying to build some units you know get more units for somalia since again uh, Somalia has a lack of deployments, a lack of reserves, uh, I'm having trouble with that, so I decided to just build some more units and also buy the American Bradley Infantry Vehicle because I've had enough of Russian unit designs, they suck, I'm sorry, I'm just gonna, be, I'm just gonna say it out there, they suck, I hate it, the T-80, T-90 tanks, no good, the, what was it, what was it, using? oh, that's the Chinese, the Chinese ZBL-09, I thought it was alright, thought it was going to be one of the, uh, or I thought it was one of the more better designs, I guess you could say. Uh, but, oh, it doesn't show right now since I have it. Let me just go over to India here real quick. Here it is, ZB09. You know, pretty average. It's average at best. But I wasn't expecting for it to take a lot of damage, especially against engineers, BTRs, and whatnot. Are you kidding me? And yes, I did switch the, uh the main avatar, the picture from Donald Trump to an anime character from the anime called Gate, and thus the Joint Self-Defense Force fought, which was ba which is basically modern Japanese military. You guys, you guys know what modern military is. Fighter jets, helicopters, tanks, and whatnot, you know, guns against, let's say, Skyrim, you know, something like something like Skyrim against dragons, swordsmen, archers, uh, what else? Basically just like that, modern military versus medieval fantasy crap. But, you know, it's on Crunchyroll, it's called Gate, and you guys can check it out if you want. So yeah, I just changed it to uh, a character from that anime, Rory Mercury. Alright, enough of that, I gotta change the name for Donald Trump as well. Donald Trump is gone. Trump Rising was completed a long time ago, so that's why I had to change it. It's about time, right? So anyways, uh, ZB09, Chinese design, didn't like it anymore. Switch over to the American Bradley, bought that. And as for the Russian tank, even though, as I've said earlier, I really don't like using the Russian tanks. Very, I don't know, they take a lot of damage, very weak for some reason. Uh, I'm still going to use a T-80 tank. It's not the T-90, I'm using the T-80 UM-2. I'm still going to use it. Oh well, we'll see what I can do. And again, Ethiopia declared war while I was trying to build and repair my units. Alrighty then, let's get this show on the road. They just want to do it right now. Let's dance. Just while heaven, baby. Here we go. And of course, there's really not enough supplies probably in the area, as you can see. Very light bluish. Always press the S key to check the supplies in the area. Oh, we've got... A bunch of units coming out of the middle of the desert. Are you kidding me? There's not even enough supplies for you guys. Oh yeah, these Ethiopian units are not going to make it. I, however, do have a lot of supplies in this area here in the desert. So I think I'm going to send about 18 units that way. So that way I can probably destroy them. And speaking of which, I got to point this out earlier in the video. This is going to be a pre-recorded part. I don't know when I'm going to be uploading this video. But I'll be uploading... Lucy part 6 which was which I uh, streamed yesterday so that is what I'll be uploading today on a Saturday this however is a pre-recorded part and will be uploaded in the coming weeks even month I don't know and I also changed my goal for this let's play as well I did say back in the beginning that I wanted to eliminate mostly all of Eastern Africa Tanzania Mozambique Malawi all the way to uh, Sudan and even Chad uh, I changed that goal now. I'm just gonna probably recreate the Horn of Africa, Horn of Africa Emp Empire. I'm gonna have to change the uh, title name as well, from Greater Somalia to Horn of Somalia. Ah, there you go, Horn of Somalia. That sounds a lot better than just simply the usual Greater in the title. So I'm gonna switch it from Greater Somalia to Horn of Somalia, and I know that Kenya is not included in the Horn of Africa. But it's already too late to give them back their territory. So, hey. I mean, you could actually give their nation back in Supreme Ultimate. You can actually 
uh, give their land, their territory back to the country. But again, this is 2020. It doesn't have that option. So Kenya will be a part of Somalia now. And uh, again, Horn of Africa includes Ethiopia, Djibouti. I kept saying Djibouti. It's not Djibouti, but, you know, I'm used to Djibouti. Uh, Djibouti and Eritrea. And, of course, Somalia. Those are the four countries that are part of the Horn of Africa. So, as of today, I have changed my goal into trying to eliminate only the Horn of African countries. However, Kenya is basically a goner, so they'll be a part of it. New nation. <clears throat> Alright, so, as you can see, Ethiopia is having troubles over here in the middle of the desert because they have no supplies. Remember, guys, never ever send your units to where there are no supplies in the area. Deserts, jungles, tundras, uh, dense forest, wherever. Just never do that, alright, guys? You guys are gonna get your units stuck. As you can see, that tank. Alright, this Bradley's already taking a lot of damage. But look, the Bradley can at least take a lot of damage, unlike the, uh, the ZBL-09. Alright, now this T-55 needs some repairs. So far, so good against Ethiopia. What was that? A little stuttering right there. Engineers. And my sound is glitching right now. The, uh, the weapons fire right now. All you hear is tank fire. There, oh, it, it glitched again. There it goes. I'm still going to keep the sound. I don't care. I wanted some th something different in my sound, in my sound files. Alright, so the main road... It's always trouble trying to take the main road again. Not enough supplies. I I am building supply depot, but I don't think one is enough, and it's gonna take a while for that supply depot to be completed. So it's gonna take a while for me to eliminate Ethiopia. You know what? Let me just try to build a supply depot here too. Why didn't I do that in the beginning? Wait, maybe I did. I did. Let's build another one. I'm gonna build one in Hargayesa. Let's do that. I already know that there's going to be a lot of uh, hateful comments in there. It's, it's part of human nature, I guess. We're, you know, hey. But, uh, you know, there's always a lot of hate from the Somalians to the Ethiopians. And the Ethiopians to Somalians. Guys, get over it. We're humans. Come on now. I mean, it's... It, I don't know. the What is it? It's over a hundred years. Dec it's been decades. Even, yeah, decades. Hundreds of years. Just, just get over it. Venezuela is offering me conventional missiles, I'll take it. But I know that's not going to happen. Because there's always going to be hateful comments. And not just my videos, but in every video on YouTube. Doesn't matter where. It's going to be the same. Nothing different. Oh, these guys are stuck here. Good. Fresh meat. There we go. Yes. Very good. I forgot about these guys up here in the north. Where's your bounty? Remnants. Um... Should I charge in over here as well? I really don't want to try to get units going up over here to where Jabouti is. They've got seven garrison out of Abeba. Seven debris out yet. And their fabrication seven as well. They've got a lot of artillery units. That's going to hurt the most probably. They have a bunch of uh, artillery units around their capital city. Plus garrisons. So that's going to be a problem. But the worst part is probably the lack of supplies all around the area. Damn it. We got more Bradleys. Oh, that's the one I'm... Yes. No, I don't want that. No thanks, Congo. Speaking of which, hopefully Tanzania, the neighboring uh, African nations do not declare war. I really, again, don't have enough reserves. Don't have enough garrisons to deploy all around towns and villages. I just can't defend my borders. I need to build these units and uh, use it against basically both Ethiopia and Eritrea. And once I'm done with this Let's Play, I mean, it's about to end. Same thing with Honduras. Both this Let's Play and Honduras will soon end. Heck, even First Terran Empire, I'm thinking about finishing that Let's Play very soon as well. I don't want to take over the world with that. I've had enough of that Let's Play. But those three Let's Plays currently are the three that are about to be completed in that way. And once that is done... I will start new Let's Plays, and of course, the more favorable favorable ones right now are Romania and 
Romanian Republic and as Iran in the new Persian Empire. And then Supreme of the Great War, which releases in about two days, guys. Two freaking days away, the Great War releases. $20, by the way. I thought I was 40 but it's actually going to be 20 and I am psyched about that. That is good news. Usually the Supreme Lord games are about $30 to $40, but the Great War is only 20 bucks, and I'm hyped. And I can't wait until it releases, guys, August 1st. Get ready. I'll be streaming the game, uploading a bunch of videos, and right now, currently, the leader in straw poll votes for the top Let's Play right now is the Austria-Hungarian Empire right now, leading with a total of four votes, I think. I haven't checked yet, but... So far, it's four votes for Austro-Hungarian Empire, three votes for German Empire, two votes for Russian Empire, and two votes as well for China. Those are the four Let's Plays that I have on Stropol, and Austro-Hungarian, or Austro-Hungary, whatever, is currently in the lead, and it looks like I'll be playing that nation when it releases. But there is still time to vote, guys. There's a link below to my Stropol. Oh wait, never mind. This is this is a pre-recorded part. It really doesn't matter if I'm saying this actually, because this video will be uploaded in who knows actually. Oh man, what am I talking about? I basically don't even have to say that. Sorry guys. Uh, the straw poll is over, and this video is in the future. No, I'm recording this in the past, but this video will be uploaded in the future, and it looks like you guys are watching the Austro-Hungarian Empire, if I'm not mistaken. So, hope you guys are enjoying that. <laughs> uh, future me, past me, I don't know. Great War, can't wait. Well, I'm not playing the Great War yet, but my future me is playing the Great War. So hopefully, the future me is enjoying. He's definitely enjoying the game. What are you talking? What am I talking about? Adept is enjoying the game in the future. So uh, man, hopefully multiplayer does work. I hope it works. All right, so yeah, lack of supplies. I'm having trouble right now. As you can see, the bluish is just slowly dying right now. And there's a there's two engineers over there, but Ethiopia, what in the world? Uh, should I take him out? Yeah, I should. Screw it. Besides, they're stuck. Even though it looks like they have supplies there. They're green. Got these air units here, but I really don't want to use my air units at all. I want to save them. For Addis Ababa. Eritrea. I mean, they have a bunch of units around their capital city as well, Asmara. But again, not as much as Ethiopia's capital city. Oh, wow. Okay, you know what? But they have more towns surrounding their capital city in the south. I might just have to take this town and go. Wow, they got seven. Seven garrisons all over the damn place. What in the world, dude? But I think this is as far as I'll get, guys. I'm going to have to build more supply depots probably for this. So that I can continue into Ethiopia. So that I can eliminate them as quick as possible. So, again, this is a pre-recorded part, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this part of Greater Somalia. Or not Greater Somalia anymore. I changed the name. Horn of Somalia. <laughs> there we go. As always, I'm a gamer. Subscribe, like, and I'll see you guys next time. And hopefully, we'll eliminate Ethiopia in the next part. Thanks for watching.